mastectomy versus breast conservation uh, is sometimes an individual decision of the patient, a preference issue. As we know, we have a lot of data to support that in appropriately selected patients, breast conservation and mastectomy yield equivalent uh, survival results. Uh, however, there are some patients that obviously uh, because of the extent of the disease or because of other factors such as, for example, genetic risk for, uh, for developing uh, you know, breast cancer like a BRCA mutation or a young age, that sometimes mastectomy may be a better choice or at least has some advantages for these patients. So um, there's clearly sort of a multitude of factors that goes on to the decision of whether you do breast conservation or mastectomy. Uh, obviously, we have the criteria that we uh, discuss with patients. Uh, if a patient is a candidate for breast conservation, we we'll certainly offer that. But at the end of the day, it becomes also an individual decision of the patient, or we we'll take into consideration some other factors, as I mentioned, that potentially will increase the patient's risk for subsequent breast cancers, both in the ipsilateral breast and the contralateral breast. <laughs>